Which church are you going? Change, Papa Church. Huh? Change. But you are you are confused. Yeah. Eh? It's not yeah. true. That's true. Because sometimes it's like you want to get out. Yeah. From the church. Eh? Yeah. It's like you are confused now. You must stay there. Stay there. Go bless you. Because you want a church where there's a prophet. See? You want a church where there's prophecy. So it's confusing you. Yeah, amen. It's really confusing you. You are trying to say, I want a church where there's a prophet who can prophesy me. Amen. Eh? amen. Yes, sir. You know true? That's true. Are you together? Yes. Eh? yes. You know what I'm talking about? Yes, amen. You want to leave the church. Are you a pastor? Uh, I don't know. You, but you want to be a pastor? No, like I saw a vision when I was 12. What vision was that? Like a, I was watching, like I was a boy and watching an old man ministering. So that's where you think you'll be a pastor? Wow. Why you don't see the vision? How old are you? From 12 years. You're still holding a vision of 12. 12 years. What about last year? Uh, I saw recently, this week, I saw a vision that... Uh, no, I, don't say you saw a vision. Say I dream. I dreamed. Say you dream what? I saw, like a man was telling me that... Uh, I, I, I think that I don't see, but I see. Okay, listen, there's a difference between vision and a dream. Okay. So, if now you are dreaming, don't wake up and say you saw vision. Let, wait for the right time if God can show you a vision. Okay. People are seeing vision, they don't even enter the blankets and put their head on the pillow. You're free. Everybody here, if we can ask people here, yeah, there's 90% of people here, they dream preaching. Yeah. They just sleep there. They dream preaching. That doesn't mean that you are called. They just dream say, hey, Jesus is Lord. Jesus is Lord. You know, come, come. That doesn't mean. It's because you are, see, you are seeing us preaching. So you are dreaming yourself. But it doesn't mean that you are called. So don't wake up and say, I saw Vichy. I saw many people. Wait, I was in front of them. Please, don't do that. What you can do wait for God to show you a vision. And then maybe God will say, you are in a vision now. This is a vision, can you see? Don't dream. Okay, okay I saw Prophet T.B. Joshua and Makaranisa. People are seeing us because you are dreaming about us. So there's no way you are thinking about it. You won't dream. Whatever you think of, it becomes a dream. But there's a vision. I will tell you what is a vision. Can I tell you? Huh? Eh? Can I tell you? Eh? There's a difference between a vision, I'm trying to explain because there's no words that can explain that. A dream, when you always think about something, it's possible you dream it. I'm saying it now. It's possible there's 99% of dreaming it. Once you put yourself in a blanket, are you hearing that? Because your mind is waking, eh? that mind will bring you there to what you are. Because this thing will come out now. You will find yourself dreaming. So there's two things. There's a mind of the spirit and your mind. Two things. So if now you are dreaming, it is coming from your mind. You must test it by the mind of your spirit. But when you see a vision, your, your, your mind of the spirit is pregnant with the weight. I'm sure you understand that. It's pregnant with what? With the weight. And the word in the mind of the spirit flashes the pictures to the mind of the flesh. Now, even when you are not asleep, you can still dream. It's called a vision. You got what I said? All right. 
the dream is coming from your mind. But if you dream it twice, thrice, that dream might be meaning it's sure. Don't dream once and wake up and say, hey, it means I'm going to be a prophet. No. Look here. Now, when it comes from the mind of the spirit, is when the mind of you is pregnant with the word, is ruled now. And that word brings light, and that light brings pictures from the Holy Spirit to the mind of the flesh. And the mind of the flesh makes you to see a vision. I will explain this next of next year. Because I'm explaining to you, it's like, how many of you are hearing me? Lift up your hands. It's not easy, eh? How many of you are hearing me? Is it easy? You are hearing me? So, always, if you dream something, check if it's coming from your mind or maybe it's your spirit that is weak. If your spirit is weak, God can still bring it when you are asleep. Because you can't see it, your mind is weak to contain it. But if your mind is pregnant to be sustained, to extend that you'll be able to dream when you're standing. It's called vision. What will happen is, the mind of the spirit, which is pregnant by the word of God, will bring light which creates the pictures from the Holy Spirit to the mind of the flesh. And the mind of the flesh will end up looking on what the mind of the spirit is seeing. And it's called what? Huh? It's called what? If one lala vuka is called what? Lala Vuka is called what? So, Unga Laliwa Vuka and was was Sukela. So, brother, this thing, just leave it for God. Allow God to bring it by His own time. It will happen. Amen. Let me touch you. did fasting. You, you did a fasting. Yes, did. Eh? Yes, did. Because you were concerned about what is happening in your house. Amen. Eh? Amen. So, God has solved your problem today. Bring it. Come. Jesus' name. So I'm praying for him. It's like he wants to go to Pumalan Mall. Uh, you can see, look at him where he's going there. Pray for him. But this mother was praying a lot. Where is she? The one that I was praying for. Because she was doing a fasting, fasting, fasting. You fasted, but today God is using that fasting. Amen. So you will make it. <laughs> Let me pray for you. There's a dream you are, you are dreaming too much concerning the dead. Yes, dead. Eh? Yes, dead. We need to cancel it. It must never come to you. Amen. It's the spirit of death. Just put a mic in the mouth. It's a demon. It's the spirit of death, this thing. Leave her. Why do you want to kill her? Huh? I said, why do you want to kill her? You demon. I must pray for you against what is happening to your marriage. Amen. Because you are, you are crying about your marriage. Amen. Did you are no longer trusting your husband. Amen. Because you are, you are suspecting he's not living right. Amen. Huh? Amen. Did you say amen? Amen, Papa. You want him to carry on that way? No. You want him to stop? Amen. Huh? Amen. Yes or no? Yes.
you have tried business, yes. but you have failed completely. Many times. Even now, you are, you are, you are contemplating what you can do. Yes, eh? yes, yes. But you must carry on with business. God wants to bless you. Amen. You know, this is the, like a last kick now of Thank the you. devil that is happening to you. Thank you. Where you are confused. God wants to honor you. Let me touch you. <laughs> Help him when he's falling down. Come. There's this pain here. Yes. Eh? Amen. It's a serious one. Yes. Sometimes it pees you like a... Like a needle. It's true. Eh? It's true. Come on, you demon. You, you're a demon. Lift her up. She's heavy. Lift her up. Out! Out! Put, put your mic in your mouth. Out! You demon. Leave this stomach. Leave the stomach. Yeah, 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 yeah. What are you doing there? Yo, Sinida. Yo, Sinida. You keep it. Nigga. I'm not going to go away. I'm going anyway. You're not I'm going, going anywhere. To yes, I'm here to destroy her. Where are you sitting? Yeah. Here. In the mind. So, yes, on the head. So, what are you doing this time? I'm destroying her every day. You're de destroying her. <sighs> Remove yourself. Yeah, 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 yeah. Macanis, I don't want her to see the direction huh? of her life. Yes. Remove yourself. <sighs> Jesus' name. Jesus' name. Okay, okay, I'm going, I'm going. Huh? You're going. <sighs> Jesus' name. You're free. Rise up. Stand up. We need to pray for, for you. Are you not smoking? Pardon, sir? Are you not smoking? No, I don't. Eh? No. Be careful of this kind of spirit. Because in your family, you people, you are drunkards, smokers. Yes, that's eh? true. That's true, man of God. Eh? Yes. Even eh? my brother, you see, eh? he, he, he drinks. My brother drinks. My Everybody uncles. drinks. Yes, a lot so of So even yourself, you are losing hope in the things of God. Yeah. So yes. this thing can lead you there. God loves you. The demon of smoking. Lift him up. There's a demon in him. Come on. The demon. Come on. Leave him. Leave him down. Leave him down. He's free. Stand up. Where's your wife? wife. Where's she? Yes. It's your wife, this one. Yes. Yes. So always you are seeing a bad character. Yes. Eh? It's yes. this demon now. Because she's free, you people must enjoy marriage now. Thank you, yeah, sir. You're yeah, free. Rise up. Where's your husband? He's at church. Huh? He's at church. W which church? Elohim Revelation Ministry at Zonleben. Why you didn't bring him here? He's busy at church. He's a pastor. He's a pastor? Yeah. So I want to pray for him. I want to anoint him. Okay. You understand? Yeah. Because he's facing tough times. Too much. If he's even losing the church now. Yeah, he's losing hope. Huh? Yeah. Yes, pastor. He's losing the church. Yeah. This is the thing that I was speaking about here. Trusting ungodly people Amen. destroys the church. Amen. Tell him that he will make it. Come on, you demon! Can you just go away from her? Go away from her. Go away from her. Out! Out! You demon! Out! Come on! Lift her up. You demon. You leave this ch Come. If we don't pray for you, because always, already you've been praying fasting. Yes, sir. But now, what you've been fasting for, it has never come to pass. So, I want to join you with prayer. Amen. Thank you, So Jesus. that God will use you. Amen. We have been asking God to use you. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. There was a time you asked God to show you a place where you want to go. Yes. Huh? It's true. You are free. Can you just tell us? You are sick. You are very sick. 
I see you're sick, Mama. Yes. Eh? Yes, Pastor. You know you're sick. Yes. Sometimes you feel this. You feel your bones. Yes. Eh? When you walk, you have to balance. You feel your bones this way. Yes. This one. Pastor. And they are also hitting your waist. Too. Yes, Pastor. So today you are free. Just come. God loves you. You understand? God Thank loves you. you. Thank you. Don't look at these people around you who are discouraging you. You understand? Yes. Because there's these people here that you were forming like a team. But it's like they don't understand what you want to do. Yes. Eh? Yes. Others they come to you for prayer. Yeah. A eh? lot of them. They come to you to pray, but they go back and leave you. Yes. It's when true. I pray for you, you are going to make it. People will come and lift you up. Thank you, Jesus. <sighs> Can you stand up here? You won't die. You won't die because there's a fear of death in you. And uh, whatever you are doing is not working. It's eh? true. It's true, man of God. Okay, yeah. It's true. There's a fear of death on you. And whatever you are doing is not even working. You it's understand? true. Eh? Where is the brother wanted to marry you? It's not. Eh? I don't know. He just left you. Yes. God loves you. Let me pray for you. There's still too much life in you, but this demon must leave you. Demon must leave you. Lift her up. Can you just help you people? Come, leave this lady. Leave her down. Huh? I say, leave her. What are you doing to her? Huh? What are you doing? What do I do here? Mm. You demon. Be careful of their sensitive spirits. You understand? Amen. You understand? Amen. Because when I look at you, I see people who used to worship the idols. Ascensor spirits around you. You make people sang on us. Come on. Come on. The spirits are blocking everything in this woman. So everything about you is blocked now. I meant it. You are, you are struggling. Everything. Everything. You are, you are in debt. Everything. I'm yeah. not working. You're, now you are in debt now. Let me touch you. When I touched this brother, I saw accident. I saw accident. Be careful of accident. Thank you, sir. Uh, because it is not the first time. Devil wanted to put in accident before. Yes, huh? man. Yes, man of God. And you overcome. Yes, man. Now devil wants to bring it back to you. You are going to overcome this Amen. time. Amen. Because devil knows that you are dangerous to Satan. <laughs> this man is a prayerful person. He's Thank a warrior. You, Jesus. you know him? Yes, sir. How do you know him? He's my husband. He's your husband? Yes. He's always praying. Yes, he eh? is. He's yes. a warrior. Yes, he is. So you, Satan Jesus. wants to kill him by accident. It won't happen. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. There's a problem of your side, yes. but it's beginning to affect your leg now. Yes, Papa. especially in your bed. Yes. Eh? Yes. So when you do like in your bed here, yes. When you do like this, you feel pain. Yes. But God wants to heal you in Jesus' name. You are free. Can you just stand up, my brother? There's somebody who disappointed you. Yes, yeah. Huh? Yes. There's a lady yes, yeah. who disappointed you. Even it's now true. when you are here, you don't trust a woman. Is it true what I'm saying? Yes, yeah. It's huh? true. It makes yes. you to be angry. Yes, yeah. It's huh? true. Yes, it's but true, Papa. Can you just forgive? God wants to direct you. He wants to bless you. There's yes, also yeah. money that is coming to you. Yes, yes. Because yes, you are trying to do business. I saw you drawing some things. Yes, I want to go to, to, to huh? a business of property. Of I property. want to go to. to yeah, property. I see you drawing something. It will happen yes, yeah. in Jesus' name. You are blessed.
Okay. Can you just stand up here? When you think, most of the time, my, your mind becomes lost. It's like you are losing your mind. Mm -hmm. And you are beginning to forget things. Eh? Yes. It's going to attack to you. Are you yes. hearing that? Yes. You know what I'm talking about? Yes. You are free. Amen. Can you stand up here? You are going to move from where you are staying. Because that was your prayer. Yes, Papa. Huh? Yes, Dad. You have been praying to move from where you are staying. Yes, Dad. It's not true. Yes, Dad. Huh? Because yes. you are tired. These people around you, people are giving you problems. Yes, Dad. But you are going to move. Can you stand yes. up? God bless you. God loves you. There's a, a money that is coming to you. Thanks. You people must hold it in the right way. Amen. Are you hearing that? Yes. There's something like money that you receive. Your husband will receive it. Amen. We'll but see. you people hold it. Are you not waiting for money? Um, he got the money. You got the money? Yes. Okay, you people must hold it in a right way. Amen. Because I'm seeing Satan try to scatter money from you. Amen. You, you got the money. When, when was that? Um, when was it? October. Yeah? October. October. Are you still having the money? Uh, yes. Huh? Yes. Are you not scattering it? Mm. Just a little bit. A little bit. Be careful. Eh? Amen. Yeah, because uh, this money must sustain you until something happens. Okay. There's something that is coming. Thank you. Are you hearing that? Yes. It must, this money must not scatter. Okay. It will frustrate your children. Okay. That's what I'm hearing. But God wants to honor you. Amen. Are you hearing that? Yes. Because I saw something will happen. So, something is happening already. When we are here, I see something happening. I see this man working. Yes, he's working he's now. He's working now. Yeah. Yes, I see him working. I see him prospering. But don't scatter this money. Okay. God bless you. Thank you. You know why I'm telling you you don't scatter this money? No. Because I saw the issue of a business. You people be careful about doing business. Okay. You understand? There's someone who's doing business in the family. My sister. Eh? My sister. Please don't be, I mean, don't do any business. Okay. According to me, take this money, invest it, it will work for you. Amen. Can you stand up?